And right now, we are starting a new career track, which is Data Analyst in Power BI. And officially, we are starting today. And see, this is the Data Analyst in SQL. And we are starting the next one. It is so Data Analyst in Power BI. I learned a lot in this Data Analyst in SQL, and I'm actually still practicing and owning my skills. Probably I'll still share some of the ways I've been trying to maintain those knowledge and actually put it into practice. But officially, we are starting the data analysis in Power BI today, and the goal is what 100 days of learning. I want to try and cover all the topics here for the next 100 days, and after that, practice, 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 and you solve a lot of problems from data set online. So that is the goal. So you are welcome officially to this learning journey with me. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you'll be the first to know whenever I go live. So data analysis in Power BI, which also involves certification. So the goal is to learn how to, learn how to master Power BI, one of the world's most popular business intelligent tools. So in this interactive learning path, which is co-created with Microsoft to pass the official PO300 data analysis with Power BI exam. So it says here, with Power BI, so there's no prior experience required. You learn how to import, clean, manipulate and visualize data in power bi all critical skills for any aspiring data professional so two hands on two hands on exercises you learn data analysis best practices and discover a world of power bi functionalities including data modeling DAX, power query and many others you will also receive a 50 percent discount code for the microsoft pl 300 certification after completing completing the track to help you uh, so there will, there will be a 50 percent discount code but i've actually already started for the exam already uh probably if i have someone who has been consistent with me learning this through this learning journey with me i may actually offer that coupon code to one of you in the comment section so i don't so i promise to offer that this code the 50 percent discount to anyone that follows through and that's exactly all I've been doing so far. I will have to have so the criteria for that. I don't know that yet, but I actually have to give it to the person which is who is truly deserving of the coupon code. You must be following, you must be subscribed, and you probably have to make sure you, you do all the projects I've done and everything I'll be doing in this live stream to qualify for the coupon code. You have to make sure you are, you are consistent with me in the learning journey. You may be the lucky person because I've actually registered for the exam already. So having the coupon code giving it to somewhere else is much more better since i have registered for that exam already so without further ado let's enroll so we have 48 hours of learning to cover 17 courses over the next 100 days oh, I'm, about, I'm about to click this one two go yeah officially we are starting to learn power bi all right you've joined the data analysis power bi track start track so we are starting officially. Let's start. You can see we have introduction to Power BI, which is three hours. Introduction to DAX. That's funny. From introduction to Power BI, they jump to DAX. Oh, it doesn't really matter. We have data visualization in Power BI. We have case study analyzing customer churn in Power BI. Cool. So immediately after a couple of lessons, we start playing with data sets. Data preparation in Power BI. And data transformation in Power BI. That has to do with Power Query. Maybe on Pivot, Transpose. Append and join tables, okay. Data modeling in Power BI, all this by a very important concept to know. We also have intermediate data modeling in Power BI. Cool. We have case study HR analytics in Power BI, DAX functions in Power BI, intermediate DAX in Power BI, exploratory data analysis in Power BI, trend analysis in Power BI, reports in Power BI, report design in Power BI, data connections in Power BI. Deploying and maintaining assets in Power BI. Oh, so let's get started. Probably I need to launch my Power BI desktop. Let's see if I can launch that. Oh, probably I'll need it. I don't know yet. Well, let's see. While that is launching in the background, we are starting track immediately. Let's start for the next 100 days. So, introduction to Power BI. Oh, let's see. Let's see. We have quite a lot to cover so each uh, each chapter actually contains is each chapter or each course in the track have four chapters 
So let's get started. We'll just start right now. Let's learn. Let me just switch my... Yeah, okay. Hi, I'm Yasin, and I'll be one of your instructors for this introduction to Power BI course. We'll cover the basics of Power BI and have you making reports before you know it. Microsoft Power BI is a tool that helps organize and visualize data from different sources. It lets you connect to data, clean and structure it, create visualizations, and easily share your findings with others. Visually representing data lets people interpret and analyze data faster. For example, it's easier to find the most profitable year in a bar plot than scrolling through a spreadsheet. There are several tools for business intelligence, so why Power BI? According to Gartner, Power BI is the leading BI tool. Over 97% of Fortune 500 companies use Power BI. In total, Power BI has over 6 million customers. With so many companies around the world using Power BI, learning and mastering this BI tool can help you progress in your data-related career. Are you convinced yet? Let's learn more. Power BI Desktop is one of the main components of Power BI. It is a data analysis and report creation tool available on your local computer. It includes powerful features like the query editor, and it's free to download. In this course, we'll use Power BI Desktop. This course will use the free version of Power BI, but there is a paid version called Power BI Pro available.